Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and I hope you're ready for another wacky road trip adventure because we are in a little game called Polyroam. And in this one, well, we have another old jalopy and we have to hit the road to fight bosses. So yes, I guess the selling feature of this one is, as you can see over here, we need the heads of massive bosses so we can add them to our shrine. They're out there somewhere and we have to go find them and survive as we're doing it. This is a survival game as well. Uh, but yeah, the whole bossing feature sounds pretty interesting. So here's our starting supplies. We have bullets for my gun, which is probably pretty good. Of course, a wooden spear. That should be able to take down a boss, right? Uh, hello, by the way. This is your home base stock with survival basics. Your mission, go out and beat up evil bosses, grab their heads, and bring them back to the shrine. I wasn't lying. Look for special enemies, beat them up. Sometimes they drop vendors, even boss trackers. Vendors should be useful in your situation. Okay, so it sounds like there's gonna be quite a bit out there. There is different biomes. I did test this game and I was in a winter biome, so it is randomized, which is cool. And I guess the biomes have tasks. Complete them for extra rewards. I don't know where the tasks are, but that's pretty cool. It sounds like it's gonna be kind of like a more in-depth long drive, which I am... Oh my god. Did not expect that. Sorry, I'm easily uh, distracted and I didn't expect to explode a freaking bird with that. That was fantastic. All right, this gets me way more excited for this game. So yes, here's our car. It is random. Uh, looks like we got a pretty decent one. We just got to kind of build it here. Oh, I can just take everything. So can I take my house with me? Okay, this is the bed that I cannot move. I don't know why I can take everything else. Okay, back to the car. I'm assuming, is there anything... Oh, wow. Okay, so is this random stuff? Is there anything good in here? We do have an extra engine. Oh, there we go. Okay, so... Oh, no, no. Go back, please. No, I don't want to get in. I want to attach it. There we go. Uh, we got Eugene the engine. Do we want Eugene or do we want the... Uh, this one looks better. It doesn't really explain the difference. So I'm going to go for this one and then we'll put this one in the in the inventory. I guess I can store anything I want in my inventory. So we, we have a spare if we need it. And I'm just going to drop this furniture because why would I have that? All right, we got our water cooler. I believe I need to probably fill that. And indeed I do. Okay, perfect. I'm assuming my engine might need oil as well. Do we have? Yes, we have oil and gas here, I believe. Yeah, that one must be oil. This must be gas. All right, so we can drain our gas. It looks like we can mix our gas as well if we want to. Uh, if we do need to get to that point. But there we go. Gas is done. Uh, why is there a red button on my house? Oh my god, I have to press it. Why is there a red button on my house? X to compress far- <laughs> What? <laughs> Can I bring it with me? What the I'm so confused. <laughs> I can bring my home with me? All right, that was by far the weirdest yet. That was even more weirder than the actual birds. I'm very excited for this journey. I've already been shocked by the weirdness of this game already. So let's get out there. Goodbye, small furniture. Oh, aren't I uh, a civilized fellow? Look at me and my little mustache. All right. Well, I don't think it matters which way we go. It did say open the map and... Okay, there is a point of interest. 72... Did I say kilometers? 72 kilometers?! It's like an hour of driving, man. Okay, well, there's something 72 kilometers this way. I don't know if we'll last that long. We'll see what else we can get into. If I got to drive 72 kilometers for something to happen, this is a really grindy game. <laughs> All right, well, I've driven a grand total of one kilometer and I'm already intrigued. We are supposed to survive along the way. <gasps> oh, God. Oh, my. Is that a freaking giant? Okay, I have to think about this. Do I want to... <laughs> use my spear or do i want to waste my bullets or maybe i can stealth what this is such a weird game there's a little girl zombie thing too oh god oh no oh oh okay oh my oh my god okay okay you know what i am not trusting this let's not deal with this guy this guy is too big for me dude he's not dying it's a good thing he's very slow this is what i was worried about i knew he'd take a lot of bullets there goes like half my freaking ammo and what the frig are you? Oh, it's a forest boss. I've already gotten the boss. Oh, no. Okay, well, that's good. So I think that leads us to the forest boss. Oh, we ah, God. Sorry. <laughs> she came to me quick. All right, that wasn't too bad, actually. I don't know what we just got there. I think that was currency. All right, well, I think we got rid of all the evil things here. So now we get to loot shotgun shells, I guess. Oh, great. Press F to use my flashlight, and it does nothing. So uh, I guess... <laughs> 
did I forget to pick up my flashlight or something? <gasps> oh, I hope it doesn't get too dark. That's going to suck. All right. Well, I, I thought there'd be some cool stuff in the home. There is nothing in this damn home. Well, I guess we can move onwards here. Hopefully, I can figure out the flashlight one day. I want to see what this rock is. It's glowing. Or of power. Well, let's see what that means. I just got to whack this a hundred times. Ah! Oh, God. Jesus Christ. That scared the hell out of me. Oh, my God. He's grabbing me. I can't move. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. This game's actually horrifying. All right. I do not want to die because I have that boss thing. Where did he come from? I don't want the aura of power anymore. Screw the aura of power. It's the aura of scares. All right. So, let's see how this boss thing works. So, we have this. I don't know how to... I don't know how to use it, though. I'm, I'm pressing the button. It says, keep on hot, hot bar tracks Mrs. Forrest. All right, so I guess we just got to keep it on the hot bar and it tracks her. Is that the... That's not the 71 kilometers, though, because I was there before I even found this thing. I'm not really sure how this thing works. Hopefully, we can figure it out. Oh, thank God. Is this something? I'm getting a little nervous. We are pretty much out of fuel. So I'm actually going to get nice and close and utilize my lights here because we have got that extra battery. So I can see. I think we know what's going to happen here. I'd like to save my ammo if I can. All right. I can't I can't save the ammo. I'm just going to use all my food just to heal myself. Fortunately, as you can see, it takes a lot to kill these things. I need to find some freaking gas, though. I'm going to run out, like, legit in a minute. Oh, thank God I found gas. Okay. I was wondering what that was. Can I mine? I feel like there's a lot you can do in this game. Okay. I got to heal just in case I find someone else. Stores 15% health. That is not enough. I don't know what these bones are for, but I'm going to keep those. All right, so I'd like to stay around, but I'm having a hard time seeing. I'll grab this door in case doors and, you know, car parts are worth a bit. Uh, I don't want to stay around too long because now I have to worry about my vitals as well. So, yeah, I'm just trying to... Oh, God, it's so dark. I'm just trying to not waste any time. So, yeah, we're going to have to get out of here. One thing I didn't look at was this. What are these? Is this dog food? Yeah, it seems like on the inside of the homes, there's not much. Oh, crap. This is a mixture of gas and water. Oh, this is water? I thought, why would water be in a freaking jerry can? I didn't think it was water. I guess I can drink it. Mm. <laughs> God damn it. I probably just screwed up my car. I just assumed it was gas. I mean, hey, it works. The engine's not going to like me, but it works. What's concerning is the fuel is still at 11%, so I don't think the water is really helping. Well, it's daytime. Hopefully, we can find a gas station. Oh, that was the sound I was expecting to hear. I can't even steer. That doesn't make any sense, game. You can steer when you're out of fuel. Oh, damn it. I don't even see anything. I was hoping down this hill there'd be something. Oh... <laughs> I had two cans. Oh, God. I'm so sorry, everybody. I, I mean, it's good because I have fuel. I knew I had fuel. I, I used the frigging water instead of the fuel can. Okay. Crisis averted. We are back in business. There is still 4.9 liters of water in there. I don't know how to get it out. So we're just going to add gas to it. And I mean, it ran fine. So it, sh it should be good. Well, isn't that a little bit of paradise? Okay. Ooh, is this a store? <gasps> this might not be zombies. They, they look somewhat normal. I'm going to have my weapon out just in case, but... Oh, they're, they're, they're zombies. Damn it. <laughs> the sexy zombies. Come on. There's a store in the back, isn't there? I really don't want to waste the rest of my ammo, man. I don't have any food, though. Dude, sassy zombies are the best friggin' zombies, though. I, I will say that. All right, please tell me this is a store with, like, zombies out front for some weird reason. <gasps> oh, God. I have lots of shotgun shells. If I could find a shotgun, that, that would be great. Thankfully, this guy's slow. I don't want to... I, I could probably use the spear, but I feel like he might have a bit of a longer reach than me. Is he sneaking around? All right, man. There, oh, my God. It actually worked. I got... <laughs> I got so lucky. All I needed was one hit. Okay. Well, we got some graves. Fantastic. Dude, why, where are the stores? I need a store. I'm sick of this. But this is, this is good to know. So I'm thinking pretty much every area has jerry cans we can loot. I just have to obviously find them. But now I, I don't care about jerry cans now. What I care about is food. I, I'm actually going to die. All right. Well, I'm wasting time. So we're just going to hit back to the road and see if we can find anything else. Oh, crap. My battery's dead. That's okay. We, we have extras. All right. Now we're going from a meow meow battery to a milk energy battery. This one's a bit smaller. So this isn't going to last long. Oh, shoot. It's dead. <laughs> 
why was everything dead at the start? So now I need a battery. I mean, maybe there's something in that old milk energy, please. Dude, I am struggling. Yeah, this thing is done. There's, there's, no, there's no way I'm getting this thing to run. All right, well, welcome back to the house, ladies and gentlemen. I figured we'd try one more run here. With a game like this, you kind of have to get lucky with certain runs, and I feel like I might have got very unlucky. Plus, we've learned a lot now. A lot of this stuff is actually pointless. I'm going to bring the tires, though, just in case, and that is pretty much it. Just put gas in my engine. Uh, well, you know what that means. <laughs> Time to start a new game. Because I don't think my engine's gonna like having gas in it. At least in the in the oil reservoir. Oh, look. It's much nicer now, anyways. Except, wait, wait. <laughs> How am I getting out game? Come on, man. Are you serious? I appreciate that it's randomized, but I don't even want to deal with that right now. <laughs> Just get a try again. Well, good start. First stop, I get a weapon upgrade. At least I hope there's a friggin' weapon upgrade from a wooden spear. Uh, yes, this is what I, I was talking about. Just sometimes <laughs> your runs are very unlucky. This is much better. Just looted freaking grass. I don't know. You can loot everything. <gasps> Ooh, a new meow meow. And this one's actually got charge. Oh, thank God. Thank God I decided to do a new run. I also saw a little something something out back. Oh, speaking of the devil, we'll grab that as well. Oh, I wonder if there's something on the roof. That kind of tells me that maybe I can utilize this. Uh, nothing on the roof, but that's what I saw out back. Uh, I can compress it. So that's something that's pretty cool about this game. Same thing I did to the house. I can store this and build it along the way if I do want to. That's unfortunate. I thought there'd be a bunch of stuff in the, um... I just stole their damn mailbox. Sorry about that. I didn't mean to do that. There you go. But yeah, I was hoping there'd be some loot in there. Ooh, I wonder if... Is that actually food? See, this is what I hate. Sometimes it's just, like, visual. That's creepy. All right, so yeah, we got a car. We got a hell of a lot more loot this first stop. Already, this is a much better run, and we've only done one stop. We got really unlucky, man. Ooh, this looks nice. Another car? Are you serious? We're going to turn off my lights because we've learned last time that uh, batteries are hard to find. Uh, is there... Oh, there is an extra... Yes. Ah! Is he inside? Someone's growling at me. Oh! <gasps> Oh my god, I got a freaking rifle too. And there's an engine here. I really wish it wasn't so dark. All right, so what we're going to do is just compress this and loot it, and I'll loot it later. We can probably build a whole new car now if we want to. There's also this engine here. So yeah, I'll uh, loot more of that car when it's daytime and I can actually see what I'm doing. I wonder if I can break this. Oh my god, I can. That's actually fantastic. All right, we got more car doors. Is that a shotgun now? This is what I'm talking about. This run is so much better. We got gas as well. This looks to be... I thought, I thought that was like a burial site. We do got someone on the inside. Yeah, he's uh, pretty big, it looks like, too. All right, actually, he's not too hard. So I'm going to save the rest of my ammo. And there we go. This axe is so good. All right, this place... Oh, I hate having to do this at nighttime. I can't see. This place is actually furnished. It's a whole freaking house. So I feel like I might miss something if I leave. But I don't want to wait either because I have to survive. There we go. At least the things that are important show up. As you, can saw, as you saw by that. So yeah, I think we're going to move on here. We can't screw around. And just turn on... Oh, that's a street lamp. I'm a genius. I'm a freaking genius. <laughs> Not that there's anything in here anyways, but I can bring this with me if I need a light. I think I will do that. Compressed street lamps. Didn't know I would want that. Oh my god, is that a gas station? Is that a freaking gas station? There might be zombies on the roof, but I didn't know they freaking existed in this game. Please tell me. We can get some gas here. Some good use out of this thing, that's for sure, with how many zombies are here. There we go. I feel like I'm doing this right now. Oh, and look at this. It's just like mine. Might actually just want to move over to this one. Wow, 99% durability. We do, have some, uh, we do have a lot of gas in it. I think we might actually need to do that, or we'll just store that one and move over when we want to later. What is that? Oh my god! It's a freaking mace. All right, hold on here. Hold on. We, I don't know what's better. A mace? Is this lady pregnant? Is it weird that I feel bad about this? I mean, I don't want the baby to be born, but I still feel bad about it. All right, so yeah, as I said, we're going to move over to this one probably just because of how much gas it has in it. And I can't seem to siphon in this game, or at least I don't have a siphon. So uh, yeah, I'd, I'd rather just move over to this one just because of the gas. Assuming everything else is good, we just want to make sure fluids are topped up. Actually, this only holds three liters. I believe I have a bigger one in here, don't I? 
Yeah, I do. This is definitely bigger. That's five liters. So we're going to dismount that and install that over here. And actually, this thing already has uh, oil in it. So it's ready to go. Uh, battery's a bit low, but that's fine. We are good to go, baby. We just got to move everything over. All right. Goodbye, old and hello, new. Don't know if it's an upgrade or not, but at least we got gas in this one. So that should be good. It's also a bit more durable. All right, guys. Well, this is go. Whoa, easy now. Holy crap. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay. Okay. I was going to say this is going well. I almost killed myself there. Jesus. But yeah, this is going pretty well this run, all things considered. It seems like it's a bit of a grind this game, which I love. I was hoping it would be challenging. We're still 45 kilometers away from whatever is 45 kilometers away. I don't know if that means it's a new biome or what. But I think we got our vitals dealt with now. We should be okay to survive in this game. And yeah, if you guys like this, let me know in the comments below. And we'll definitely do more in the near future. As always, thanks for watching and liking. And I'll see you in the next one. Hey there, before you go, I just wanted to let you know about my second channel, Gast. If you're missing my multiplayer shenanigans, then please consider checking it out. Scan the QR code or copy the link down below. Okay, bye. Get the frick out of here. You have to win. Hit him. Let him get the shovel or the tennis racket, dude. Oh my god.